In this video, I really just want to share with you what niacin is really used for and how the how the body utilizes it. Now, before I get started, uh, down below, I'm giving away a free video-based guide all about uh, giving you tips on shopping for supplements and, and herbal medicine out there. Now, niacin is often called uh, vitamin B3, and it's, the reason it's called B3 is the third B vitamin that was discovered. Now, throughout history, there's this disease known as pellagra that would cause problems like diarrhea, mental problems, and scaly skin sores, which doesn't sound very fun, right? <clears throat> then in 1915, a physician named Joseph Goldenberger did some experimenting and discovered he can actually create this disease in people by altering their diets, which is pretty wild, so it was a big discovery. Turns out when someone doesn't get enough vitamin B3, well, they get this disease. Now, the human body has tons of uses for niacin, um, but one of the primary ways it's used by the body is to break down food and transfer that into energy for, for us. This is why if someone is deficient in this stuff, a, a big, um, well, they're probably going to be really pretty tired and fatigued, and, and that's a sign of a deficiency. Uh, next, your body uses this nutrient to help cells communicate with each other. And you might be wondering, well, why would that why do cells need to communicate with each other? Well, I'll give you a, an idea on how this can be helpful. As humans, we're pretty much like survival machines. We're here to survive. And we have something known as the fight or flight response, which really utilizes this cellular communication. Uh, this means if you're in the jungle and you see this huge mountain lion come rushing towards you, your, every cell in your body will be on high alert to give you a, somewhat of a chance of not dying. Now, another way uh, cells use this vitamin is to aid in the growth and the health of the cells, which is kind of important because you don't want damaged cells apart from wrinkly skin and create um, ailments and diseases. Can you name a deadly disease caused by a damaged cell? You might be thinking about cancer, which definitely is caused from a damaged cell. Also, uh, vitamin B3 plays a, a big part in keeping blood pressure at a normal rate and this helps the whole cardiovascular system. In fact, according to uh, the Journal of American Co College of Cardiology, they looked at 11 different studies out there with 10,000 people, so this is big, and they concluded that this nutrient does, in fact, uh, lower the chance of cardiovascular disease. This not only helps uh, someone not have heart disease and, and a stroke, but if you think about it, it helps in so many other areas out there, like with thinking, more blood to the organs help that organ out. Um, even it helps guys when it comes to their partner and well, getting the job done. So it helps in that regard. Another really cool thing about the substance is, believe it or not, it can even help with arthritis. Uh, there was a study done by inflammatory research that found that patients with osteoarthritis experience better joint movement and lower infl inflammation after three months of taking this vitamin. That's kind of cool, and there's some other benefits that may someone may experience, such as uh, even motion sickness remedy and insomnia. Now, of course, you can get it through food. Another idea is to get just take a daily multivitamin supplement to get it. And that's why I usually, you know, why not? Just get it, take a multivitamin. Um, of course, there's a lot of products out there. Some are crap. And to help you, I, I made that guide, which I talked about earlier. can give you some great ideas and tips on what to look for or what, not to, what to avoid in those supplements. So that could be somewhat beneficial. It also goes over herbal remedies and some, some weird alternative medicine that could help you and put more money back in your pockets, which is nice. It's free, and it's a lot of fun. I think you should check it out. Click on the link below this video to learn more. I really appreciate the time, and uh, please leave a comment if you like this video. It, it was helpful. Uh, please get, hit the little thumbs up button. It helps me a ton, and uh, enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.